Let's take a look here at knowledge mining. This is a discipline in AI that uses a combination of intelligent services to quickly learn from vast amounts of information. It allows organizations to deeply understand and easily explore information, uncover hidden insights, and find relationships and patterns at scale. This is a term that was kind of coined over at Microsoft. Uh, you don't hear about it over at Azure or GCP, but it still is uh, a good uh, concept to know. The other thing is that when we look at RAG, so that's Retrieval Augmented Generation, there is a lot of overlap with this, or in many cases, you can look at RAG being knowledge mining. Um, but let's talk about what we have here. So the first thing is ingest, then we have enrich, and we have explore. So ingest is ingest content from a range of sources using connectors to, fir uh, uh, to first and third party data stores. So we have structured data like databases, CSVs, unstructured data like PDF, video, images, and audio. We have enrich, so enrich the content with AI capabilities and let you extract information, find patterns in deep, deepening understanding. So for managing AI services, we have vision services, language services, speech services, decision services, and search services. Now, those literally map to Azure uh, AI managed services, but we're talking about AWS. Uh, when we're talking about vision, we're talking about recognition, we're talking about language. Um, I guess that could be something like, um, <laughs> I'm trying to remember the service that does NLP here. Uh, I can't remember it off the top of my head, but for speech, we have Polly. Um, for, for search, this could be mm, not necessarily an AI search. Well, it could be Kendra, right? So there's a lot of managed AI services that can be utilized at that level. Then we have Explore, so the newly indexed data via search bots or existing business applications and data visualizations. So here, it could be used in a CRM. It could be in a RAP system. It could be Power BI. And I didn't list it here, but it could also be used to return back to an LLM to interpret and then complete regs. So there you go.